Right now, local Girl Scout troops are selling boxes of their favorite cookies. They are all over the newsroom this morning. New this year, those boxes feature a reimagined design, and there's a deeper meaning behind it. Christina Laurie is live this morning to explain. Hi, Christina. Josh and Leah, at first glance, these boxes might not look all that different, but this year's branding focuses on the G-I-R-L of being a Girl Scout. That acronym stands for Go-Getters, Innovators, Risk-Takers, and Leaders. And this morning, we want to introduce you to some local Scouts who are all of those things. Get your cookies here. Step right up. Whatever their pitch. Hello, would you like to buy some Girl Scout cookies? These girls are ready to make a profit. If they give us a $20 bill and they're only taking one or two boxes, I'm like... You know you can get five boxes, right? Learning skills like upselling. And then they look at me and like, really? In this digital age, how to actually talk to people face to face. When you're talking to people and you're like, just, you know, they, they, they're more interested. And how to find their purpose. One of the best things that you can do is to just take a moment and think about, am I doing this just for me? Over the next six weeks, Badgerland Girl Scouts are selling their beloved cookies for $4 a box. It's, it's Girl, Girl Scout, Scout cookie time. time. If you buy cookies, some of the funding goes to our troops. Three quarters of the money stays local, paying for things like summer camp. Some of the time we use the money for things like philanthropy and donate it. But for now, nothing tops the experience of selling. This is so much about teaching girls essential life skills. Except for maybe the taste of the cookies. My favorite cookie is the peanut butter patty. I really like Thin Mints because I like when you put them in the freezer, how they're like hard, they're like a little crisp, so you like bite them and it's just like snap. It's really hard, they're all so good. And the sisterhood cemented through every sale. I love having my Girl Scout sisters at my side. Now, my favorite cookie was the Savannah Smile. Unfortunately, the girls are not selling that this year. That went out of business last year. This is the last year for the Thanks A Lot cookie. A lot of people love that one as well, but I want to be here and testify that these freeze super well so you can buy a couple extra boxes, chip in, help support these local girls' dreams, and you can put them in your freezer, and they'll still be good for next year, Josh and Leah. And also, I have a link on our website of where you can find your nearest Girl Scout cookie seller this morning. We're at the Duncan on Park Street. That's where they'll be this weekend. Thin Mint's frozen. I love that Yum, idea. that does sound really good. Ah, cookies and some life lessons. All right, Christina, thank you very much. All the cookies frozen. Oh, yeah. There you go. Throw them all in there. Thanks, Christina.